February 18th is Ash Wednesday and the beginning of the Lenten season. Centenary is once again offering its midweek meditations from 1215 to 1245 every Wednesday during Lent. Take a short break away from your work week to enjoy some soup, a short meditation, and worship. Okay, it's uh, Italian dinner time again. We need some help. Here, what about this fellow? Let's try him. Okay, reckon he can cook? I don't know. He doesn't look like he's a cook. Maybe he can sing. Maybe he can sing. Maybe he can wait a table. We need some of the men to step up and help us on Saturday the 14th of February. Uh, it's in the evening. What time? It's a start and we'll serve from 5.30 to 7. See you there. Don't forget your tickets for the men's Italian dinner are available at the church office. Tickets are $10 for adults, $8 for youth, and free for children six and under. Last week, a lady came up to me and said, George, you wrote a wonderful little article in our newsletter. I liked it so much I read it twice. I didn't understand a word you said, but I liked the way you wrote it. So I thought I ought to take a second shot at explaining what I'm trying to say. In the Protestant tradition, the, certainly the Wesleyan tradition, uh, we are called by God to make a connection with Him. Really, we don't make the connection. He connects with us through the work of Jesus Christ. What we can do, though, is to cooperate with God in pursuing that agenda. I've been privileged to, to work on Protestant, uh, a Protestant form of meditation, various forms of Protestant discipline in my life, and I would very much like to share that with the congregation. It's a call that I'm feeling. If you feel called to, to participate or to grow in this way, I strongly urge you to come to the, to the uh, prayer room uh, Wednesday night, February the 18th at 6 o'clock. I'll be there until 6.30. I would love to support you in any way I can uh, in your pursuit of a connection with God. Hello, Centenary United Methodist Church. My name is Nigel Eastman. I'm the Director of Student Ministries here. And February 22nd, we are having a pie auction. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be right after the 1050 service here in the Activity Center. So get signed up to donate pies, bring your friends so you can buy pies. All of this helps the students go on their ski trip happening in spring break. Uh, they work so hard, they serve so much, and now it's time for us to have a little fun, and you can help by getting involved in this pie auction. I'll see you there. We are taking another mission team to Kobe Hill, Bolivia this summer, June 14th through the 23rd. There is an informational meeting Sunday, February 15th, in room 102 at 12.15 p.m. for anyone thinking about going or wanting to know more about the mission. We already have 12 plane tickets reserved and are finalizing the trip budget, which should come to around $2,000 for each team member. First deposit of $200 is due Monday, February 23rd. The informational meeting on February 15th will go into more detail about the trip, the budget, deposits, and any other questions you have. If you have any questions, contact the team leader, Tabitha Beckman, at 350-7620 or tap the Beckman at gmail.com. We're doing reading again this year at Lincoln Elementary School. We plan a, an organizational meeting today at immediately after church in 102. If you're interested at all, please come. We won't be there long. We need volunteers to help third graders prepare for the state test in April. We also need a few volunteers to help with the lab, the computer lab. We'll be meeting Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday from 7.45 to 8.30. We'd love to have you. It's a great opportunity to evangelize and do mission work at the same time. If you have a friend that's not associated with the church that's retired or anxious to do this sort of thing or you think might be interested, include them also. You can contact me at 571-3172 or leave your name at the 
church office and I'll call you. This coming Wednesday, February 11th, is our celebration night in Logos. Please join us at 640 in the sanctuary to enjoy what the children and youth have been working on in Logos this quarter. All are welcome. You will leave with a happy heart. Have you tried giving online? Set up an account and you never need to write a check again.